Okay, so in this tutorial we're going to take a look at using this GUI skin for our HUD. So right now, if you look here, we have um, our text area, our text field, all this other stuff. The box color right now is really set to transparent. Um, if you look at text area and we go down to font size, I changed it from 0 to 40. Now I want to explicitly point something out here. We're going to be editing our game manager code here. Now, let's go ahead and delete these guys because we're not going to need them anymore because we're going to use our GUI skin. We created a GUI label here. So the only attribute on the GUI skin that's going to work is under this label tag here. So let's go ahead and you can see it's named label here. Let's change our font size to 40 here as well. Now you can look at all these other really awesome features like text color. We can make that red or we'll do, I'll do it like a bright green. So that really pops. Um, and font, you know, none, you know, we can select Arial or like I said, you can import in your own. Now what we have to do in our game manager is we have to actually create a public GUI skin variable. And I'm just going to call it skin. Okay. And I'm going to copy skin here. And all I'm going to say here is GUI dot skin is a lowercase equals skin. Now you have to explicitly tell it. Now we can get rid of my style here because we're not using that anymore. Now just by writing this line of code here in our GUI, it's saying we want to use this skin. And we're going to use the label feature of this GUI skin. Okay, so but where's how's it actually connecting. Well, remember we created a variable up top called skin here. So if I save it right now and I jump to my game manager, because this is the game manager script, you'll notice that we get a new feature down here called GUI skin. So we can actually drop our HUD into that game manager and you'll notice it updated that label. So now when we press play, when we walk up to it, you'll see it'll update. In the next video, we're going to take a look at graphics, but feel free to go ahead and Play with the HUD under the label features here. Remember, we have an on hover. You can actually text color. You can change that to you know whatever you want, and you can maybe switch it with a background image. Or there's all these other cool features. Feel free to read all of the documentation online on that.